All right, welcome, welcome to Viggy3 Academy, and I think it's time that we tackle the console today. Um, so for those of you who are unfamiliar with the console, the console is like the cheat tool, uh, but it's very, very useful when it comes to self-education. So if you wanna use it, uh, go ahead and open up this, this is the launcher, and then go down to game settings, and then scroll down here, and then open game in debug mode. Click launch. So debug is gonna um, give us access to the console. We are going to still need to use some console commands. I'll, I'll show you a couple of the most common ones, um, but I think that there's a comprehensive list of it uh, somewhere, which I'll, I'll just post on the video, because I think most of it is just about you experimenting with console, learning how it's useful to you as, as a, a learner in Victoria 3, because it is a very, very powerful learning tool. Um, and so I, I want you to understand um, the basics of how to how to use it and how to conceptualize. It. All right, welcome back. Here we are. Um, so let's take a look at what we can what we can see inside this this little save tool. Um, so when you are in debug, you are going to have access to the console, but the console is still going to require a lot of commands. There are some base commands that I think are going to be really helpful for everyone to understand. The first of which is how to open it. So you open your console by pressing the tilde button, which is the one that's to the left of your one and underneath your escape key on a regular QWERTY keyboard. That's gonna open this guy up. Um, the most useful command I think anyone can ever want is help. So help is the sort of thing that if you can give it more information, um, it can give information back to you, right? So if we want to know about research, ooh, see, right? You can come up with lots of specific questions that you can ask um, the thing. You just can't necessarily ask it, um, like, help how to win. That doesn't work. Um, but if you can come up with a basic concept that you can feed to the help, uh, the help function, it can it can help you. Um, and there are some that I think are, are very, very helpful. Um, so help fast. I think this is probably the most important category of things when it comes to how to use console, because um, this is going to allow you to very, very quickly test in real life sort of the implications of um, different technologies or different uh, government forms, um, different institutions, different different laws. Uh, like this is this is the the stuff that I think is most useful when it comes to planning out, you know, a world conquest or or whatever. You can use help annex um, and then that'll tell you how to annex a country and see how it says country tag slash ID. So you can find that by mousing over this and you see it says country ID 36 SPA. So if I wanted to annex Spain, then I just do this, done, annex Spain. Um, the overwhelming majority of the value here in console is just sort of how you use it yourself. This is not necessarily going to be a long how-to. This is going to be a short how-to because I think most of it is just um, understanding the implications of using it. You can use it to do fun map, map painting stuff if you want to, but I, I think it's most useful for just sort of like experimenting and trying to figure out like, all right, what are, what are the, what's the implications of having this technology, right? Um, what's the implications of having that technology? How does automation actually affect my economy? Um, these are questions that you can answer on your own by playing the game, but if you have, if you value your time and you just want to like learn something pretty quickly, then, um, the debug, which I, unfortunately I haven't, I haven't found, oh, let's, let's get debug deer to show up. Show me. There he is. There's the debug deer. That's the real reason that you want to be playing in console, by the way, um, is that you get the debug deer is the best, the absolute, the absolute best. Why would you make it? Why would you? Why would you right click to make him go away? Oh, debug dear, we love you. Okay, well that's that's console. I think it, that once you understand how to open it and how to use it, um, that that the world really is your oyster. Uh, you obviously the more that you that you use it, like the less that you can learn from it. Cause I think a lot of the things that you can learn quickly are like just translatable skills, like how important different things actually are. Um, but but that's that's uh that's what that's what cheating is for in Paradox Games, right? It's all about education. Okay, uh, that's it. Take care.